Our mission through Madeline's Fund is to help families in need who have a child in the NICU with related expenses as well as those who experience the loss of a child to help them with the funeral costs. I have all this fabric from Madeline's nursery that wasn't being used and I wanted to do something with it. I had heard about Stephen just through some friends telling me that his artwork was really neat. We should check him out. He uses fabric. Kind of had this idea like we should commemorate the launch of Madeline's Fund by a piece of artwork. So we approached him and he immediately was like, yes, I'm in. My wife Andrea at that point was probably six months pregnant. And for me, it really hit home. It was a you know, truly a moving story and something you know, I had to be involved in. Normally, I cut into luxury fabrics like Chanel and Hermes and things that are really expensive, but this has nothing to do with money. This is sentimental fabric that, I mean, I don't think it gets more important than this. As a fine artist, you always want to have their wishes in the piece and then make it your piece as well and put your touch on it. So with this piece, we want it to be about hope and rebirth and miracles. The number one symbol for rebirth and hope is a butterfly. All right, so here was the two options originally. We got to be a part of everything. Even our two boys got to come and be involved in the whole process. That was really important and meaningful for us. There's a lot of symbology in the piece, the hidden meaning that maybe everybody doesn't know about, but of course, you know, the Lees do know about. A part of the butterfly's wing has hearts, and there are eight hearts that symbolize her eight days of life. And then there's also eight bows. The bow is our logo. Having Steven be involved in this means the world to Rachel and I. He genuinely was doing it because it touched his heart. Him putting that piece together and us being able to give him the fabric and being able to go through that process, it's another way to honor her as well. The artwork will be hanging at Hemby Children's Hospital NICU and it will serve as a piece to remember Madeline and then the good that it's doing for the Charlotte community. I think there will be lots of things that will help create that legacy for Madeline's Fund, but I think having that physical piece that people can see every day when they're walking by, if that's just something that allows you to take a breath and pause, I think it served its purpose. This is for all the caterpillars that never became butterflies, and for all the butterflies that never felt the wind in their wings and for all the hearts that had hopes and dreams of a wondrous flight together.